This is an incredible way to create a snapping effect in Scratch. Oftentimes, we'd like to limit the placement of a sprite to only a series of locations. Consider this case where we'd want to be able to place the towers only on the squares, or here, where we'd want the tiles to only be next to each other. This is called snapping, and it's frequently used in several software. Getting this in Scratch is fairly simple. So far, I have set the grid sprite to draw a series of dots 50 pixels apart each. This will of course be purely for representational purposes. Say that we want the cat to only be able to place itself on the dots. Well, when the green flag is clicked, add a forever loop. Now set x to the rounded value of mouse x divided by grid size, the whole thing multiplied by grid size. Similarly for y, just change mouse x to mouse y. Test this out and you should have snapping. This is enough if the sprite can remain in the center, but in some cases we'd want the sprite to be offset by some value. Let's say we want the cat to be offset by 25 pixels on both the axes, so it's at the center of each of these dots. In this case, we'd need to slightly modify the code. In this case, add 25 to the final output and also subtract 25 from mouse x. Use the same block for y, just changing mouse x to mouse y. And that's it. Test the program out and the snapping should work perfectly. Now, you can use this feature in any one of your games.